what this video is because we do this every single year. So here it is again. It is, drum roll please, my back to school, backpack home, 2018 sophomore edition. So this is my backpack for this year. So make sure you guys subscribe to my channel and also stay till the end of this video so you guys can see the huge giant giveaway item that will be included in this backpack. All right, so I'm gonna start with the outside of my backpack. I feel like this is a different kind of backpack than I've had previous years. I'm not gonna lie, when it first came, it was a different color than I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be more of like a vibrant yellow, not like neon or anything, but just a little bit brighter and it's actually mustard. But it's actually like grown on me a lot and I think it's actually one of my favorite backpacks now that we've accessorized it and everything like that. So I'm super excited about this one. So first, I guess I'll start with the water bottle. I have this water bottle here. It holds your ice all day long. So it's really nice and it's super cute. It's just simple enough, but then it has little specks of black in it that I really like. Now, the outside decorations. I found this keychain. It is adorable. It's a little llama. Guys, llamas are in this year. They're coming in everywhere. I went shopping for all this stuff and they're everywhere. So then it also has these beads on it and I like the yellow because it like matches with the rest of it. And then the other color just kind of give it a little bit more of a pop. And on the back of the llama, it says live happy. It's so cute. So then up here, I had pins last year. You guys might have seen my video from last year. Um, I really liked the pins last year, but I didn't want to do them um, kind of the same styles last year. So I just added a few that kind of represented me or kind of matched the theme. So I have um, llamas right there. They came as a set with the no drama one and it kind of just added like a white pop, which I liked. So those were perfect. And then I have sunglasses because it's like, you know, the backpack's kind of like the color of the sun. And then a camera because I love taking pictures. And then YouTube because obviously we're here on YouTube right now. <laughs> Okay, so we're gonna go in the inside of the backpack. There's a ton of stuff in here, so I think I'm all set for this year. I'm gonna start with the lunchbox. So lunchboxes are something that I find really hard to actually find one that I really like, but I've seen these previously and I'm super excited about this one. So they didn't have a ton of color options, so I decided just to stick with black so it wouldn't get dirty over the years. I know my lunchboxes typically get pretty dirty. But this one is super cool. It's called a packet. It folds out like this and then you pack your lunch. It has like a ice thing in the bottom of this or something like that. And you just stick it in the freezer overnight and then you pack your lunch in this in the morning and it'll stay cool all day long, which I found was really cool. And then once you're done with it, you just pack it up like this. And it just kind of like compacts into this little bundle here, and then you can just stick it in your backpack. I have just a typical spiral notebook here. And this one's really fun. I think it's just simple enough, but it also brings in all the colors that I have. My color, I don't really have a theme, but I wanted to kind of get colors that all match. So my colors are like um, blue, gray, white, and then just kind of like earthy tones, I guess. So now I have these white notebooks, and these are a little bit smaller, but I like them this size, especially for like my WAP class. I'm taking an AP class, it's called WAP, and we do a ton of writing, and I like the smaller ones for that because they're easier when I need to study for them. Uh, they're a lot smaller, so I don't like have to travel around with like this huge big notebook, but I love that it has a tie on this. It kind of binds everything together, which I found super helpful when I had one of these kind of last year. I don't think it was at my actual haul, but I, I just adapted it into my backpack because I ran out of notebooks. And now for my last notebook, guys, I I love this notebook. It's so cute. Boom. It's a sloth. It's so perfect. It literally matched perfectly with all my other ones. Like, just look at this, guys. Look at how put together this is. I'm so excited. But it has a little tie thing, which I like to show like where I am in the book. I actually started writing in this already for my summer assignment. It doesn't bleed through. Like a lot of notebooks I have when I'm using pen, like you know you can see on the other side, you actually can't with this notebook, which I really like. This is one of my favorite items in this backpack. It is so cute. So every year I have pens in my backpack. I really like using color in my notes. I find it more um, interesting, I guess, when I'm writing notes. So I love colored pens like these. One of my friends had these last year. She used them and I love them so much that I like. Oh, we use them all the time when we had classes together. So I really wanted to get these this year. It is super fun and they'll match perfectly with my notebooks when you're writing with them. Okay, let's see, what is next? Oh, this is cool. It's basically like a draw on your own calculator. So on the back, it might give you a better picture of what it'll look like. You like draw on the numbers and stuff and it's super fun and super cute. So I thought this would be a good ad in my backpack and it kind of matches the theme, but it's super fun and I'm super excited to actually try this out and see how it looks once I'm done doodling on it. I have a pencil bag, 
So this is a cute little cactus pencil bag. I think it works perfectly with the theme, you know, blue, green, stuff like that. And it's just adorable. Who doesn't like cactuses? So inside of here, I have these highlighters. And I don't know why, but I'm so mesmerized by these. They're like liquid highlighters, I guess, but they're like see-through. So you can see the bubbles like moving around in them. I feel like I'm gonna get so distracted by these in class. They're so cool. I found last year that I actually needed a lot more colored pencils than I thought I needed. So I feel like everybody has a basic like colored pencil set, like it's rainbow or whatever. So I wanted to get something a little bit different that would still add a lot of pop to my page papers or whatever I was using to color them for. So I found this like metallic set and it still has lots of different color variations, but it's like metallic, so it's really cool. And they're different than your just regular basic rainbow colors. And now for pencils, you always need pencils. I always need more pencils than I think I do because I always lose them. But I personally like mechanical pencils. I feel like everybody has mechanical pencils now. But I find people have these and they last them all year long. So I really wanted to try these out this year. It's my first time ever really trying them. I feel like they're like the fancy mechanical pencils. If you're in school, you know what I'm talking about. The cool kids have these. It's the truth. So I'm super excited to actually have them this year and see if they last me all year long like the other kids say they do. And now, just for your basic folders, these match perfectly with everything. It kind of ties in all the colors. So I have just gray, blue, and white. They're double pocketed, which I find really nice because I like to use a folder that has like my homework in it. It's just all classes, but it's just what I have to do that night. So I do like need to do and done and like turn in and stuff. So I like when they have two pockets. So I was super excited when I found these because I feel like they're pretty durable and they won't rip when they're in my backpack. So another thing that I love about this backpack is that it has three pockets, a big, medium, and small. Last year mine only had two, so I like that it has more options to put my stuff. In this one, we get some fun, different stuff in here. I guess this isn't that fun and different. It's just scissors. To me, this looks blue, but I feel like it also looks green. So click the poll right here if you think these are blue or green, because honestly, I cannot tell. All right, and then a must need for school is some earbuds. So these are super fun because uh, they actually like wind into the little macaroon here. These are actually for the, not like the new headphone jack, but the old one. Because when I use them at school, I use them for my computer, not really my phone. And your cords don't get tangled, which is super nice, especially when you just throw them in your backpack. And a must need for any high school student, a note card holder. This one actually comes with note cards. For a lot of my classes, we take like so many notes on note cards. It's crazy, like so many. So I'm gonna need a few more of these. And it was perfect because I actually got these little sticky notes and it fits perfectly in here, which you can actually kind of see it gave it away. But these I am in love with. So I had them in like a notebook that I had last year and I could like hook it on the book wherever I was. So it was like a bookmark and it held a whole bunch of sticky notes at the same time, which I really loved and I used all year long in my textbooks, in my notebooks, and whatever. So I wanted something kind of like this this year, and I love these colors. I feel like they pop a lot in my notebooks, and they weren't that expensive, so if you guys want to check them out, go ahead and check them out. But these are awesome, and I'm super excited for these. One of my favorite things in this backpack, this was a golden find. I was just sh shopping online, and I found this, and I was like, I need this for my backpack. So, this is a cactus eraser. It matches my pencil bag, the cactuses, and it's just so cute. I have to take it out to show you guys because it's so adorable. And I feel like I always need erasers. It's so cute. Look, even the pot is an eraser. This is so adorable. I'm so excited to use this. I think you can actually stick it on a pen or something like that, a pencil, but I feel like it's much more convenient just to stick my pencil back. So that's probably what I'll end up doing. And now for the small pocket. So my small pocket, I don't know about you guys, but typically in the smaller pockets, I just stick like, chapstick or mint or gum or whatever and stuff like that. So that's basically what I have in here right now. So I have some mints. They're stuck. Mints, there we go. Because I don't actually chew gum. I used to love chewing gum, but I actually have like TMJ. It's basically where my jaw like pops whenever I open it. And so the doctor recommended that I don't chew gum anymore. So I have mints with me here. I had one of these last year and I don't even think I had, like I don't think I finished the whole thing all year long. So these last a long time. These are really good find for your backpack. And of course, chapstick. You need chapstick in your backpack all the time because 
why not? You always have to have police at school. So these are super cute and they match my theme. And they're golden. So these are actually e EOS or is it EOS? I don't know. I feel like people, it's either one or the other. People call it one or the other. But the, this is um, vanilla bean. I don't know guys, you guys are gonna have to tell me this. But is it a scent or a flavor? Because that is honestly my life's question. Is chapstick a scent or a flavor? I, I just don't know. I really can't think about it. So click the poll right here if you think it is a scent or a flavor. And of course, hand sanitizer. I use hand sanitizer all the time during school because there's germs everywhere. <laughs> and especially before I eat lunch, I always use hand sanitizer. So this one, I've never heard this flavor before. Flavor, scent, scent. The scent before, I don't even think I'm gonna pronounce this right. Sparkling, Lehman's solo. <laughs> Does anybody know how to pronounce this? It should be lemon, but it's limon. Limon? If you guys know how to pronounce this, you're probably cringing at how I'm pronouncing it because I do not know. But it smells good. It smells like nature-y. And last but not least for my school supplies, it's not really a school supply, but it's still fun for back to school. It is this adorable pop socket that I found. It is a llama, so it matches with all my llama stuff, but it's so adorable. It's wearing like a little, I guess it's like a llama unicorn or something because it has like a unicorn horn, but it's so adorable. And this again, like super cute in my phone case for back to school. So now I kind of saved this for the last because I didn't want to give away my giveaway item. But this is actually a computer case. So I use a computer at school. I know a lot of people don't, but I like carrying a laptop because I actually like typing a lot of my notes. I find it easier and I don't know, I guess I just learned better that way. But I like this one because it's very neutral. It's also big enough to hold my computer and it has an extra pocket if I need to type, I don't know, some papers in there or something like that that I need to type up later. And it also came with this like charging thing. So I can stick my charging stuff in there. Oh, I didn't even know this, look. There's a little screen thing on there. How interesting, how dandy. You can also use this for a computer or you can use it for what our giveaway item is, which is right here. Are you ready? Drum roll while I go grab the item. All right guys, I have it with me. It is a brand new iPad Pro. Here we go people. Whoever gets this, I'm actually very jealous of. I've heard very great things about this, so I'm super excited for whoever wins this. But this is actually like, they're calling it the new computer for students, I guess, because you can hook like a computer, a keypad thing to it. So it is rose gold, it is 10 and a half inches and 64 gigabytes, so it should hold all your school stuff that you need, and you're just looking styling, you know, you're just in the back of the class with your iPad Pro over here, you know, just typing or drawing or doing whatever. And you can also stick it in this computer case, which also doubles as an iPad case. And you can also stick all your charging stuff in here, so it's perfect and it's very convenient for school. Basically what's in this giveaway is a second set of everything that is in my backpack, so we can be twinning, you and me, we can be twinning and we have the same school supplies. And you can also have this iPad right here, this very one, the one that I have in my hands right here. It will be yours. But you do have to be 18 or older or have your parents' permission before you enter. So you can find all the information for this giveaway in the i1 right here or the description box below. But basically there's only one required entry and that's to do a good deed for somebody else. So it could be, I don't know, making your siblings bed for them or making your neighbor cookies or something like that. And then once you do something like that, you, it'll open a whole bunch of extra bonus entries that you can enter or complete to win more chances to get the giveaway item in my matching backpack. So for all you international people out there, I don't know, England, Dubai, Iceland, for all you guys, this can come to you too because it is open internationally, so this is all around the world. So this starts right now. That's kind of cool that I can point at you and say right now and you can enter it right this second. So that's actually pretty cool if you think about it. And it actually ends August 30th, 11.59 p.m. Central Time. So make sure you enter so you can win this awesome giveaway. So thank you guys so, so much for watching this video. Hopefully you enjoyed seeing what was in my backpack and possibly your backpack for this year. So make sure you subscribe to my channel by clicking that red button down below. And you can also check out my other videos by clicking over here. And I will see you guys next week. Bye.